Okay, well, this next film I am reviewing is a mean-spirited horror film that does target one aspect and takes on a pointless gore, gore, blood, blood fest, gore fest ride with no real substance, energy, or interest. It's called The Collector, and I shouldn't be surprised as this film was written and directed by Marcus Dunstan, who contributed, who contributed in turning the once brilliant concept of Saw into a revolving door of tediousness that has become both Saw 4 and Saw 5 and is the upcoming Saw 6. This is his directorial debut, and normally I'd say stick to writing, but when you've done such a crappy job at both, I guess it's a catch-22 for me. This is every bit as mean-spirited as films such as Wolf Creek or even the reprehensible Hostel films. I just don't understand how people can enjoy goriness merely for the sake of goriness with no real sharpness or likability to its characters or no intriguing villain. Basically, it's the same methods and stupidity we've seen in the recent Saw films. Basically, this guy just captures... Basically, the villain in this film, called The Collector, captures a family and tortures them. And that's pretty much the movie. No thought, no redeeming value, no interest, nothing. This is just a purely lazy effort from a lazy writer and director who has no ambition as a horror filmmaker. Now, how, now some of you are saying, well, you recommended Orphan last week. Yes, I did. It had interesting characters, a well-plotted story, and it wasn't overdone, and it was a horror movie that was made to scare us, not to be gory, mean-spirited, and scary in the wrong way. It was made to scare us in the right way. What made the original Saw film so amazing was the finesse of the, of the maniacs, made the maniac of the film's methods and the mystery leading up to the payoff, which was one of the best horror film payoffs in recent memories. This is garbage, junk in every sense of the word. The collector gets the big, fat, zero, and likes it.